Anterior Chamber of Eyeball, Wikipedia Article Audio The anterior chamber is the fluid-filled space inside the eye between the iris and the cornea's innermost surface, the endothelium. Aqueous humor is the clear fluid that fills the anterior chamber. Hyphema, anterior uveitis, and glaucoma are three main pathologies in this area. In hyphema, blood fills the anterior chamber as a result of a hemorrhage, most commonly after a blunt eye injury. Anterior uveitis is an inflammatory process affecting the iris and ciliary body, with resulting inflammatory signs in the anterior chamber. In glaucoma, Blockage of the trabecular meshwork prevents the normal outflow of aqueous humor, resulting in increased intraocular pressure, progressive damage to the optic nerve head, and eventually blindness. The depth of the anterior chamber of the eye varies between 1.5 and 4.0 mm, averaging 3.0 mm. The anterior chamber tends to become shallower at older age, and in eyes with hypermetropia. As the anterior chamber depth decreases below 2.5 mm, the risk for angle closure glaucoma increases. Shallow anterior chambers are endemic in certain areas in India and Southeast Asia, where angle closure glaucoma is a common eye problem and a leading cause of blindness. Clinical Significance Depth Measurement Determining the anterior chamber depth is important in estimating the risk of angle closure glaucoma. There are various methods of measuring ACD, including examination through a slit lamp, ultrasound, and scamp flug photography. These methods require sophisticated examination equipment and expertise. A simpler clinical method of quantitatively estimating ACD using smartphone photography was developed by Dr. Ehud Zamir from the Centre for Eye Research Australia, the University of Melbourne, and published in 2016. The easy ratio method is one way to calculate the estimated anterior chamber depth. To start, the patient looks at a target in the distance with one eye covered. The examiner takes a digital photograph of the open, examined eye, from the side, perpendicular to the visual axis. The following parameters then need to be measured in the photograph, using a personal computer or a smartphone. 1. The pixel distance between the limbus and the front of the cornea. This distance is referred to as Z. Easy ratio method. 2. The pixel distance between the limbus and the center of the pupil. This distance is referred to as E. Easy ratio is the arithmetic ratio between E and Z. Associated immune deviation. This ratio is linearly correlated with the depth of the anterior chamber with the following equation. Anterior chamber depth equals minus 3.3 x EZ ratio plus 4.2. This estimate has been shown to be accurate with a 95% confidence interval of plus slash 0.33 mm error, when compared to measurements of the anterior chamber depth by scamp flug photography. Pathology one peculiar feature of the anterior chamber is dampened immune response to allogenic grafts. This is called anterior chamber associated immune deviation, a term introduced in 1981 by Stralin ETL. This phenomenon is relevant to the fact that the eye is considered an immune privileged site, like the brain and the testis. Structures of the eye labeled this image shows another labeled view of the structures of the eye. 